When we knew we wanted to start our own business and knowing that we wanted to get into the customer service field of things, um, we started doing research and we wanted to find a good model and a good company that we could follow knowing what our, what our passion was, was the customer service and what we needed was the industry. When I was a teacher, I absolutely loved my parents and the kids that I worked with and I gave all my heart to them and um, transferring over to owning our own small business, you know, it's been a different type of realm to work in, but uh, still connecting with the people is the number one thing for me. I was a residential home builder for, for four years, two, two in high school and two into college. Um, we're, we built custom homes, so I had my hands on all the different aspects of home construction, from um, you know, putting up uh, all the framing, all the drywall, we ran all the electrical, we hung cabinets, we did all the painting, roofing, etc. Um, from there, I got interested in construction management and business management, and that's what I went to school for. It's nice going out to somebody's house and seeing a, a quick change that you could actually look at and stare at and feel and touch. That's the rewarding part uh, for me and why I got into construction and why I still like construction. One of the cool things about the franchise compared to just starting our own company on our own was that they had everything set out for us to do. So we literally like have a checklist of like from starting to go into these orientations and then like what do we do after that and so it made starting our own business for first-time business owners like a hundred times easier. <laughs> so we didn't start the business to paint people's homes or to paint people's businesses. We wanted to start the business to be in the customer service industry. We just use painting as our outlet. At Fresh Coat, we follow the 333 rule. We try to schedule a quote with you within three minutes. We do the quote within three days and the work will always be scheduled within three weeks. We don't try to be the lowest cost painter out there. Cost is really important to us. But we, we take that focus and we dedicate it towards the customer service and the, and the quality side of things. Um, and that, I think, is what is going to set us apart. You know, for that 5 or 10% difference in cost, you can get a 50% increase in customer service and a 50% increase in quality as well. It's all about being on time, finishing on time, being reliable, trustworthy showing people that this is this is more than just a painting company this is a customer service oriented business finding good employees um, i think really makes a difference in the business as well because they're on site with the customer much longer than we are and so making sure we're going through that process of finding professional and quality painters and that they understand that yes their job is painting but also to have a great focus on customer service I had met the Santa Barbara Boys and Girls Club at the Santa Barbara Chamber. I was involved in the Boys and Girls Club when I was in college in Waterloo, Iowa. Um, and Caroline Brown, the, the director here, had approached me afterwards and uh, she was saying, you know, for, for their anniversary, they want to do some modernizations uh, to the club, which included a bunch of interior paintings. So we, we wanted to have that relationship and develop that, that relationship as best as we can. So absolutely, we, we took advantage. and. Um, try to do the best job we can inside. For me, being more in touch with the community is the best part of it. We are giving back to the community and giving back to our own community. I agree, like being involved just in the, in the community is the best part about it.